I'm currently running macOS Sequoia, which is intended to be used with Xcode 16, because that's the most current version of the OS and the most current version of Xcode. But in my particular case, I need to use Xcode 15.4, which as you can already see by the app icon, is not supported on this version of macOS. This is the same for every single version of macOS and also going into the beta for the next macOS version, you're never able to use the previous Xcode version, by default at least. In actuality, it is pretty easy. So first of all, you need to of course have access or have installed the older Xcode version. Personally, I use Xcodes.app to download my Xcode versions, but you can of course also get them from the developer portal or from another website. This is just my preferred way. And I also have a video linked up there in the info card that explains how you can use Xcodes.app. So I already have Xcode 16 installed and I can use it just fine. Now I want to open Xcode 15.4. I double click it and you can see that there is a uh, update to the latest version pop up. And this is actually uh, very ambiguous in my opinion because we don't need to update our Mac to the latest version. We need to update Xcode to the latest version in order to open it. So we'll say cancel here. The way that you can do it is, of course, I'm inside of Finder right now. You just right click the Xcode version you want to open and you say show package contents. And you go into the contents folder and you go into the macOS folder. And then you will have this shell script here uh, that it's called Xcode. And now if you open that shell script, then a terminal will open. And then uh, in here, you of course have your uh, Xcode window open and now you can use it for whatever project you're working on.